What's up everybody, it's Ben with SRKCycles.com and today I've got a 2001 Yamaha XVZ16. Uh, I believe this started out as the Royal Star uh, Silverado. Uh, the guy did some mods to it, changed it up a bit, and we're gonna walk around this thing so you can see exactly what it is up close and personal. I'm gonna start here in the back. So your rear tire there, rear tire is decent. I'm gonna call it like 40%. Um, a lot of miles up to that, good to go for any kind of inspection you need. Um, you can see your exhaust here and here. Um, started right here in the back, we got like a, got a dent. Looks like it was touched up, so the paint isn't chipped as bad as I thought it would be. But it is a nice little mark right there on the rear fender. Uh, coming up you got the tail light, two turn signals, they're both smoked out. Got your license plate mount, obviously those wires will be covered by the actual license plate. Excuse me. Got your luggage rack there. That bolts in with the license plate. That's why that's just a little bit loose. As you can see, at one time there was a sissy bar on this bike. That's been taken off. Uh, it just has the, uh, the passenger seat up here. Uh, as you can see, it does have the hard bags. Uh, I believe they would have been added. They are not a Yamaha bag. I do not believe. Got the push button to open them up. They're actually pretty nice, quite frankly. They open and close very easily and they lock here in the back. Uh, looks like everything on this bike has been painted, uh, including the bags. Everything's all blacked out there. You can see that exhaust, the uh, Freedom Performance exhaust. Going back there, looking good. Got your side panel here, it's got a scratch right there as, my, as I'm pointing it out, right there. Um, you do have your, got your passenger pegs, got your rider floorboard, got your rear brake. Uh, if I get in here on the motor, you can see everything in there. This bike is carbureted, uh, so it does have a choke. Fuel pickhock valve, we'll see that on the other side of the motor. See all this stuff. And I believe this is the 1600. There you got the Yamaha. Uh, the one thing I did want to point out, I don't remember if we saw one on the back. This bike is covered in like Joker decals. Uh, so if you're really looking, if you're a really big fan of like interesting cartoonish Jokers, this is gonna be the bike for you. Starting with this one here on the tank. Other than that, the tank looks pretty decent. I mean, there's some light little smudges in here. And, oh, nope, nope, no, that's just a little piece of dirt. Um, so there's that. Spin it around. See the top of the handlebars there, back of the mirror, a little short windshield. Coming up on our second Joker decal, there is that. Um, you can tell that this front fairing was definitely painted. Uh, this is uh, definitely an aftermarket fairing. Uh, it does have like the stereo in there and everything, which is could be a nice addition, but it definitely did not come this way, especially not in 2001. But it does have really nice LED headlights and auxiliary lights. They're super bright. Um, they almost make it make the bike seem newer than it is, at least when you see it rolling down the road. Got a little mark here on the ferry that I want to point out. Most of this is just like just a little bit of dust. Um, so we're coming down here to the front fender. Joker decal number three. Um, there's that. Other than that though, this front fender looks pretty good. Got the fork tubes, they're in decent shape. A little bit of pitting starting right there, but nothing major at all. You know, you got the dual rotors up front. And you got that spoked black spoke front wheel. Jump up here and see this fork tube. Again, a little pitting starting there. And that rotor, black wheel from that side. Front tire has plenty of tread left on it. Again, I'm going to say it's about the same as the back, call it 40%. Um, Going to go for any kind of state inspection that you might have. Um, definitely a lot of miles left on it. Jump over here to this side. Well, we saw, we see the top of the, uh, the Handlebars here, the back of the mirror, and the clutch and all that. On this side of the tank, we got the other matching Joker emblem. So there is that. Again, other than that, tank looking pretty decent. Then here in the motor, you can see everything in there. Nice and close. The choke is a little hard to find. It's like in here, almost like underneath where the tank and the uh, seat come together. Of course, you got a fuel valve there, fuel pickock valve. Got the rider floorboard, toe shifter, heel shifter, got the kickstand, got your passenger pegs, there you go, got your side cover, 
some light marks right here on the side cover. There's one right there, and there's one right there. Like I said, it does appear that all this stuff is probably painted. There's the exhaust on this side. Again, you got these bags. You got some marks on the top of the bags, like right there, right there, right there. But I do kind of, I don't, I do kind of like the, these uh, these bags that they open. They're uh, definitely very accessible. Coming up over the top of the seat, passenger seat looks like it's in good shape. I got like no marks or anything to report there. All the stitching in along here is pretty good. I don't see anything, I don't see any tears or even like any like stress marks there. Got your, uh, got your rider seat. And that is good to go. Again, same thing. All of the uh, seams look to be good. So there you go. Coming up over the tank. Again, we saw that from the side. It looks like everything was pretty much painted. Got your, uh, speedometer there you know you got your clutch all your controls there throttle brake kill switch uh this does have the uh it's like a kenwood stereo there so there's that uh 39,286 miles uh there'll be a few more than that after sean does a test drive if you're interested in this bike make sure you get on youtube and check out the test drive let's fire this thing up so you can hear it run let's give it just a little bit of choke Turn signals work. Got your front signal on that side there. Got the other signal up there. Jump here in the back. There's that side in the back. And there is that side in the back. Alright guys, like I said, this is a 2001 Yamaha XBS 1600. I believe it started out as the Royal Star. Obviously you can see they added the the fairing and the bags. But if you're interested in this bike, make sure you check out the test drive video and thanks so much for watching.